what's going on boys and girls it's your boy Medus. now today i am going to show you a little bit about their devil's health's kitchen and what i really like about him it is not the same old videos you're seeing on youtube explaining his abilities etc this one i will explain exactly what i really like about him and from what you guys already know you already know his strengths and his weaknesses um basically he is very strong when it comes to non-damaging debuffs um i wouldn't say he's good against omega or apocalypse or somebody like quick well basically anybody or any champ that reduces ability accuracy because he's very dependent upon that or any champ that is not bleed immune, uh, bleed immune. yes yeah, so so basically those in those categories you would not want to use him um He's actually pretty good for a lot of fights. He's actually very good against Void because of those dam um, non-damaging debuffs. Um, I like him for counter tactics. I like him for prove yourself because he does not lose his combo and do you bleed. He actually works pretty well from there. As you can see, this matchup you're looking at is just Dead Devil on his own, no synergy. You will also see when I do get hit, my combo usually goes down one um, hit from the combo meter for every hit that the opponent does which is actually very good um when you're fighting champs like um void you want to stay under 15 which is fine because even if i'm at 44 or 45 and i do a heavy i will consume 10 which means i can rely on my heavy to keep void at bay which also reduces um it doesn't reduce but what that will do it will bring down my combo meter along with um, their devil's ability to um, purify those non-damaging debuffs now with that all said and done I want to show you why I really started to enjoy their devil I started to enjoy their devil because of his synergy with um, spider Gwen now if you don't understand how that synergy works is that whenever I charge a heavy attack I can miss so as you can see there blades unblockable sp2 was completely missed by their devil the reason for that is because you have a window of um, 1.5 seconds I believe where that attack will miss doesn't matter if it's an sp1 or sp2 or heavy it doesn't matter what attack it is it has 100% chance to miss now this match will really showcase their devil and his ability um this is invisible woman and as you could see he is just going down on her now even when she's invisible she also gets a reduced um ability accuracy which means i think he reduces the ability accuracy of um invisible woman by 65 percent if i am not mistaken yes so um his attack when he's above 15 hits it reduces the opponent's defensive ability accuracy by 65 percent so even if it's invisible woman or for example one i really love um dark hawk you won't be able to miss um that in itself is brilliant i really enjoy that especially when um when you have a, a non-damaging debuff on you it also increases your attack which is great i mean that's fantastic plus you will always have a um a precision buff every time you perform a heavy attack which is awesome um when i discovered that i actually really enjoyed playing him believe it or not it was a lot of fun now as you could see mine is still ranked one but those fights are not very long fights those fights are short fights and the numbers are between hmm, it's it's not mediocre it's actually pretty good in my opinion it's good it's not bad it is good so his yellow numbers are between 1k and 3k for a uh, rank one um, should I take him up to rank two I am so thinking about it because even for fights like um as you can see i've just been purifying those non-damaging debuffs because every time a weakness debuff gets on me as long as i am under 15 it will miss 
I'm actually going to evade all of those attacks. Well, not evade, but have all those special ones miss. And that's something that I really enjoy. Now, having those attack miss, I have a, a 15 seconds window cooldown. Now, as you can see, it has been activated. So after 15 seconds, that has been activated. That um, the, um that ability has been act, um, activated and I could use it again. And as you could see, I fully had a special two miss. And this is this is the exciting thing that I love about him. I do know that we have to bring Spider Gwen. But Spider Gwen is also an awesome champ. Believe it or not, you could check out um, Sudia's um, video on Spider Gwen versus. I think who did who did she go against? I can't remember. But he did go a beast of legend with Spider Gwen against someone. Maybe it was Thing. I have no idea. No, it wasn't Thing. It was Luke Cage. Now, as you could see, Silver Surfer special two attack completely missed. Now, I know you're going to say, but it's not that difficult to evade. I know that. But at the end of the day, it was fun having it miss. And I'm going straight back into attacking him. Now, as you can see, it's activated again. And all I have to do is wait for him to drop that um, special attack and hold my heavy. Now in that one I went for my heavy too early trying to beat out the special attack but it did not happen. Another thing that um, you're supposed to look out for is that like I mentioned earlier he will be good against um, do you bleed nose because his sp2 actually does a lot of damage a lot of bleed damage and his sp3 which is a very good thing now if you spam his special 2 he will get a, a, a something called a rage debuff now the rage debuff only lasts 12 seconds but that's fine and when the debuff ends um, it will replace itself with a fury buff now when it does replace itself with a fury buff you get a certain amount of attack rating for 25 seconds now that is actually pretty good so for the long fights to make it fun i would suggest spamming that special too um well it depends on the fight so as you could see the special two was done and that fight is over um what else when you do the heavy attack you get a precision which will also increase your critical rating so daredevil has a lot of benefits you just have to play him and really try to enjoy it. and that's what that's what I did. I really had to play him to understand how he works. And in my opinion, he is not a bad champion. Um, I got hit there by um, Captain Marvel's special one, but that's okay. What I want to get her to is a special two attack. And the reason I want to do that is to show you how easy it is to evade her special two. The reason for that we all know that the last two shots on her special two causes a lot of damage plus turns you so as you could see i waited for her first the first part of the special two and then as soon as that was completed i just took my time and wait for the last two bit of that special two which is the beams and uh, i simply had it missed now another good one is good for is agus agus Aegis heavy um, as you could see I am going against this rogue here and I could start off with a heavy the same way we start off with quakes heavy now once you start off with a heavy automatically their attack will miss and you will get two hits in to remove that Aegis heavy now that's not a bad thing it's 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 quite brilliant now even with unblockable attacks it does really well as you could see completely miss Groot's um special to unblockable another good one you should say it's good for is whichever champ has an armor up buff you could spam your special two which does a lot of damage for um that bleed um as you could see now this is this is a difficult special two to evade but with this synergy it's completely easy all you do is hold your heavy when he dashes forward and dex the last part of that special two as you could see completely missed and i just love it so i took it out for a little experiment and i went against a beast of legend dark hawk now as you could see he's in his stealth mode now if you know how dark hawk works 
majority of the time you would not be able to hit him when he is in that mode also you will know that his special one is very difficult to evade but dead devil is making cupcakes or cheesecakes out of it and i really enjoy now i do know there is a 15 seconds window but when there is a 15 seconds uh, 15 seconds window you just have to understand that during that time you just play defensively or still attack and take that special on the block which is fine there's nothing wrong in doing that but as you could see i am still causing a lot of damage on dark hawk even though he's in his stealth mode which is quite brilliant and that's because daredevil like i said reduces ability accuracy by 65 percent and that is a lot um would i take him to rank two just because i enjoy playing him i most definitely will because this game is totally about who you really enjoy playing with daredevil on my radar has been good um the synergy with um spider gwen just makes it a lot more fun for me and i really enjoy him i enjoy playing him too bad i do not have the um required required um items to take him to rank two but if i did he would be one of my first options because i really enjoy his mechanics along with that synergy with spider gwen so if you guys understand how it works it takes a little bit of time to really get used to him but when you do get used to him it is all fun um hope you guys enjoy i will take him against apocalypse to show you that one of the the most difficult specials attack as you can see i'm only going to use daredevil along with spider gwen and we all have a problem of evading the special one of apocalypse well some people do but at the end of the day if you do have a problem and you're just playing for fun this is another easy way to do it the good thing about the miss is that you can activate it whenever you're ready um it's not difficult to activate all you have to do is perform a heavy so right now i'm going to show you the sp1 so i'm going to dash back he's put his feet down now i'll perform my heavy attack which will make all his special attack completely miss that is freaking brilliant <laughs> i really enjoy that as you can see it's, it's it's not too difficult what about his special too um it's trickier well it's yeah it's trickier than the the special one but with the timing and the spacing all you have to do is evade the last bit of his um special too and i'll show you that again for you to actually perform that really well you just have to dash back all the way to the end of the screen wait for the beam to reach halfway and then perform your heavy he will come to you and perform another miss and then you just start evading after that it is quite simple now i know a lot of people will say well tiger can do it um yes she can but she will remain on her heavy which means if you're far away from him you will get punished um so is she a good option for him she is a pretty good option can she do it on your timing uh yes but there are repercussions to that as you can see i am now going to take daredevil with um winter soldier just a rank one daredevil and have a bit of fun i will show you guys how i learned to evade this was actually the first one that i did learning to use that heavy mess so as you can see i got clipped but i realized maybe i started a little bit too early on the heavy and i think it took me about two tries to really get it and then from there i don't think i will make a mistake now as you can see 3k to 4k and the bleed is on him plus the rage is on me i think the rage um the rage fell off so i have the fury buff now and as you could see yep daredevil is going to town now this is this is a lot of fun for me because i don't care about pushing him to the sp2 see again the last peep got me but then like i said it's all practice i'm going to spam my um my special two now as you can see every time i spam my special two the numbers and the yellow numbers the yellow numbers just make me so man 
it increases which is good especially if i perform a heavy to add that precision buff on me with that fury oh man i'm telling you you cannot go wrong and there you have it ladies and gentlemen fully learned how to evade the special two you could do it for a lot of champs like blade like winter soldiers you could do it for um what is that guy's name the punisher you, there's a lot of champs that you can use daredevil for if you want to have a bit of fun now the other thing about it is sometimes you have to be aware when the um when the, the ability actually refreshes so sometimes i will forget that it's refreshed and then totally miss um if you perform the heavy attack at a perfect timing what that does is after they perform their um after they perform their special attack you can counter them with that same heavy that actually missed so as you can see my heavy miss is ready and i am going back in now do not mind the um counts here on the hit you have to remember that um it actually reduces every time i perform a heavy so do not be mindful of the hits on the left because that is totally not the amount of hits it will take but as you could see this fight is going really well and the yellow numbers are not bad i have completely healed from the non-damaging debuffs and this fight is almost in the back except for the fact that i just got hit there <laughs> i really thought it was activated when it wasn't but anyways guys hope you enjoy hope you learned a thing or two and go out there and spam that special too it does do a lot of damage and does do a lot of bleed damage and one last time i'll show you my favorite thing i love about daredevil peace